So you have two different forms of maturation. You have nuclear maturation, which requires DNA replication, which requires folate. But as I mentioned earlier, you also ha re, uh, have cytoplasmic differentiation or maturation. Now that is more uh, due to RNA, which doesn't need folate as much. And so then what happens is, if somebody is deficient in folate or B12 or both, because they work so closely together, that what you get is that when the nucleus is trying to mature and, and replicate DNA in order to divide, it can't. The cytoplasm, which doesn't require folate because it's using RNA, does mature. And so what happens is, and I mentioned this before, a cell just doesn't necessarily split. What happens is, is it wants to make sure that these cells, after they split, have sufficient cytoplasm. So it, the cytoplasm matures in preparation for division so that each cell has enough cytoplasm. But what happens is, is if the nucleus can't mature, if it can't replicate its DNA, then the cell can't divide. And then what happens is, so you get cytoplasmic maturation in preparation for division, but because the nucleus was lacking folate or B12 or both, it doesn't. Now we have a slightly larger red blood cell than normal. Cells, incidentally, that also don't divide. So let's take this another step. And by the way, you can review these videos. We're gonna talk about it in the weekend. We can ask questions.